friends, I'm Bianca Renee and you're watching Bianca Renee today. And today I'll be doing another Halloween tutorial. If you haven't watched my previous video, make sure to go back and watch my last video where I did sadness from inside out. And today I'm back at it again with another Curl Smith sponsored video. And today I'll be using the color copper to create not one, but four different Halloween looks for you. Did anyone ask for four looks? No but I get really excited when I use my hair and makeup. The costumes that I'm gonna be doing today do not require any crazy face paint like last time. This is very like no makeup skill friendly looks and they're really good for like last minute costumes that you might have these items around the house or you can order them off of Amazon where I got most of my costumes with Amazon Prime and get it in time for Halloween. And my first costume is going to be Camp Possible. Yes, we're taking it back to the 90s. If you don't know who Kim Possible is, you're too young for this video. But I'm going to start off with my water bottle. Get my hair nice and damp to apply my leave-in conditioner. Now I kind of forgot this step last time, but the Curl Smith hair makeup does work really well when you apply a leave-in conditioner first because it can be kind of drying depending on your hair type. So I'll be using the Curl Smith Weightless Air Dry Cream as my leave-in conditioner. Now some of you might be thinking, Kim Possible does not have curly hair. It's straight. I know this. But I'm a huge advocate of just making your favorite characters curly. We don't have too many curly costumes to choose from, so I just like to make the curly versions of the characters, and it turns out just as cool with no heat damage. All right, so now I've applied my leave-in conditioner. It smells amazing, so moisturizing. But Kim does have a side part, so let me just go ahead. Is it on the right side? I think it's the right side. I'm just gonna create a little side part right here. Oh, dramatic. Gonna finger tangle this on the side. And now the fun part, let's grab the Curl Smith Hair Makeup. This is the color copper, it has no sulfates, parabens, or silicone. It has apricot, orange peel, pumpkin, and carrot. We know what all of those words are. That's what I'm talking about. Real, organic, vegan ingredients that we can pronounce. So I'm gonna apply a very good amount. Copper is one of my favorite colors out of the hair makeup line. Let's go ahead and start on this side. Oh yeah, <laughs> looks good already. So because Kim's hair is straight, I'm not gonna fluff out my hair. I'm gonna keep it as flat as possible to still give like the illusion of the Kim Possible hair, but keeping my hair curly. I've also noticed that the hair makeup works best or is most vibrant on dry hair. So I'm just gonna kinda use this as my base, and then I'm gonna go back in when my hair is dry and apply more. Dang it! Don't put it on your face. It's not face paint. Doesn't matter where, doesn't matter, doesn't matter when. I will be there for you till the very end. In danger of trouble. I know you guys want me to sing, I'll just stop, but. <laughs> you know you were singing along. You know you were singing along. I should brush this side, do I have a brush? Of course not. I'm just gonna use a pick and kind of brush this part out. So this is a very, a very gentle start but I don't wanna waste any more product on my hair while it's wet because it just isn't as vibrant. So I'm gonna let this sit as is, let it create a little bit of a cast, and once it's dry, we'll go ham. So just in about maybe 20 minutes, my hair is already almost dry, which is amazing for these gels. So now I'm going to complete the drying process with my diffuser, but I will not be making any volume by scrunching it up or upside down like I normally do, because I want to keep this slick, kind of wet look to mimic her straight hair. Now 
my hair is about 97.2% dry, but I do want it to be more vibrant at this point. So let's add some more copper. There we go. Now the current copper is a very pretty everyday look, but since I'm going for cartoon characters, I want this to be orange, like Crayola crayon orange, as if I was an animator drawing this. Not that animators draw in crayons, but you know what I mean. So hard for me not to fluff this out like I normally do, but we're gonna keep it tame for Kim. I do love the shimmer of this copper. So pretty. And there you have it, the completed look with the fully applied copper. It does not stain your hands or skin at all. But this is as flat as my hair is going to get, but still looking curly and the color is just popping. And now to complete the look, let's put on the costume. Right, let's move on to the next cartoon. Taking it back once again to the 90s, because I'm a 90s baby. Rugrats, let's do Chucky Finster. Now Chucky's hair is kind of just wild, so let's just puff this out as much as we can. This is where it could get a little messy because you are kind of like scrunching it so you might see some like copper little pixie dust. So maybe don't do this on your white carpet, but it doesn't stain and you just kind of dust your shoulders off and you'll be fine. It is gonna be a little harder going from a flat look to a big look, but I'm gonna make it work. Ooh, I really slicked this part down. So I'm gonna refresh with some water, which means we could be taking off our color. So I'm just gonna add a little bit more to any parts that I mess up. Now let's diffuse for volume. <sighs> okay, there's the Chucky volume I want. I don't know, what should we do? His hair's kind of crazy. Let's just, I don't know, let it fall where it wants. Maybe middle part. Perfect, now, Let's get dressed. from the Rugrats with special guest Tommy Pickles, my son Jalen. But now, let's keep it going with the cartoon 90s theme and now head over to Cartoon Network and do Miss Cerebellum from Powerpuff Girls. She is a character that you never really saw her face. I think there might have been like one special episode where they actually showed her face. For the most part, it was just right about here. But big orange hair and then a super bottle shaped body. My body ain't that uh, bottle shape right now, but I can at least make my hair very big. So let's do it. So I'm gonna split my hair in sections and I'm gonna try to comb it out to make it as big as possible. This is like the complete opposite of what I tell you guys to do to get definition, but the costume 
calls for it. We are going with volume over any definition. It's big. I will admit, by doing this, I've kind of like scraped off all of my colors, so I did make a mess and there's like little pixie dust everywhere. So if you are going to fluff it out, be careful where you do it. Maybe just do it in the shower so you can just wash it off. Mind you, it's just, it just wipes right off. It's not staining anything. But I do wanna think I'm gonna add a little bit more color just so it's extra vibrant. So let's add some more. Now, let's put on the costume. <sighs> I know what you're thinking. Where can we possibly go from here? The only place you can go from here is up. So, let's put our hair up with a costume that takes it even further back to like our parents' cartoons, or I guess maybe your grandparents' cartoons, depending on how old you are. The Flintstones. Let's end it off with Wilma Flintstone. So in order to do this, I'm just going to put my hair up. She kind of has like a little like pompadour and then a bun. So I'm gonna take this front section. Oh, this is gonna be very fun to detangle. Ooh. Okay, that might be good. Okay, that could work. Let's put this away. Oh, good, another scrunchie. And then the rest of it is going to go up in a bun. an actual bun but let's leave it curly this could also be like an I love Lucy look so here's the updo but now let's add a little bit more copper and remember if you get any on your skin just get a wet cloth this is just a baby wipe and just wipe off anything that you might get on your ears or your neck, and definitely your hands. So now let's go ahead and put on the final costume. Wilma Flintstone. Woo! I had so much fun making all these costumes. Although Halloween is like kind of canceled this year depending on where you live, it's still a lot of fun to dress up and just have fun at home. I'm literally gonna go to bed after this, but I got some cute pictures. I got a video for you guys. So just take some pictures, have a fun Halloween Zoom call, make the most of it. If you want to get some hair makeup for yourself, they have copper, they have turquoise, they have ruby, rose gold, and gold. These are all available at Ulta Beauty or on the Curlsmith website. And I actually have a promo code to share with you. So if you're looking for 10% off any of the Curlsmith hair makeup colors, use my code Bianca Curlsmith for 10% off. The code does expire at midnight on Halloween, so stock up while you can. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I post new videos every week. You also can follow me on Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter at Ms. Bianca Renee. I'll see you guys next time. Happy Halloween! Thanks for watching. Bianca Renee.
today. 